Today's plan with me is a collab with Phone Jones. Be sure to go to subscribe to her channel and hit that notification bell. Today I'm going to be working with three layouts. I couldn't decide which three I wanted to do, so we're going to do my weight loss layout, my catch-all calendar layout, and we're going to do my social media layout. So we're going to start with the weight loss weekly layout. Okay, so if you've seen my last planner video, you've seen all this before. So we're just going to speed through it. There's no need to waste time in showing you how I measure out my boxes. You can go out, go back and watch that video and I will leave it up here in the corner. And link in the description box. But as you learned in my last video, I love washi tape. So let's washi tape it down. And move on to the planning so I have been writing this in a different journal and I decided to move it to my happy planner because it was more convenient and then I figured I would stop losing the journal if I just added it to my happy planner. So what I like to do is keep up with what I eat for breakfast, what I eat for lunch, and what I eat for dinner and if I have a snack, I add it under one of those boxes where I have the snack. I like to keep up with how much water I drink, my workouts, my steps, and my carbs. Also. And a few other things I like to keep up with, but this is just the main thing. I like to take my weight at the beginning of the week and also my weight at the end of the week. And I put those in the notes section. And this is how I'm going to be tracking my weight loss. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and click that notification bell because I'm going to start back showing you my meal preps. And all of that is coming up this week as I get back on my healthy eating plan and start back losing weight. I'm not really big on decorating this because I do so much writing on it, but I do like a little color. So I just try to find a few stickers that go with it. And then I also um, incorporate some stickers through the week as I eat. I like Because I don't know what I'm going to eat just yet because I ha haven't completely meal prepped all this week. So I like to add a few little stickers as I go for the week and bring a little color into it. Kind of make it motivational to see the color. But I'll try to remember to share these meal prep ones with you just to see my progress through the week. Um, at, the, at the end of the week, you know, like when I do the next week's, I'll try to share the week before too, after the PM.
this is my catch out planner weekly layout and this is where i put like everything i'm gonna do for the week all my dates all my tv shows everywhere i have to be my work schedule just everything the kids appointments the days i have my grandkids that i'm going to babysit the days that i'm going to do hair pretty much where everything will go on here so i normally use happy planner but i didn't see stickers in the happy planner that i wanted <laughs> kind of for fall that matched this color scheme that i threw together i probably need to start finding my stickers first and then match my washi tape but hey anyway so i'm gonna pretty much well use this almost entire page since it's the color of my washi tape and lay it all out and see what we come up with So I noticed that I forgot to lay a row of washi tape and I'm going to go back and throw that washi tape in under that keep calm sticker. <laughs> I'm going to tell you because my husband is actually sitting behind me in the room and we are talking, having a good conversation right now. And my mom is just somewhere else, but I'm going to fix it. I really wanted a cute banner, like some motivation to go up here at the top, preferably on the right side. I kind of really don't see one that I want though. I I know I have some because I have a ton of sticky book um sticker books, but I just like I said, me and my husband are in a deep conversation right now, and you will find out about that conversation a little later. Uh. I just don't want to discuss it right now, but you'll have to know about it <laughs> at some point. But yeah, it'll be a little later and you'll find out what it's all about. But 
yeah i'm just gonna put this little banner up here because i thought it was really cute and i don't use a lot of banners but the color scheme was perfect it's like pink it's got like a hint of pink in it and it's green so hey it'll work in place of putting some motivational like washi tape up at the top so we're gonna run with it these sticky books by the way are the pin and gear sticky books from walmart i happen to really like those i used to use these a lot in my regular planner before i became a happy planner and i decided to keep using them because i really like them plus they are really inexpensive and if i just get really sticker happy there's no love lost i don't have to go back and look later and be like oh my god i wish i hadn't wasted those nice pretty expensive stickers so i can stick them kind of anywhere and mix and match them with anything including my happy planner stickers also so you'll see me use those a lot Even though I have plenty of stickers that I could use to make these little bullet points, I just find more happiness in doing my own using this stencil. And I also like to freehand them sometimes. I'll take out my Papermate flare pen and just doodle something sometimes. I just like to doodle. And like I said, even though I have tons of stickers and I know some people are like, well, why didn't you use a sticker or a bullet point? Because that was just too simple. Sometimes, you know, I like to just draw myself and so that's what i did i probably should use different color inks on some because that's what i normally do like i use a different color um pen to make it colorful but I, like i said my husband and i are in a deep conversation so like right now i'm just trying to concentrate and i got a lot to think about a lot of decisions and choices to make so i'm just going to keep on planning thinking and focusing I am in such deep thought that I accidentally tore, <laughs> tore this sticker, but no problems. I'm gonna make it work. It's all good, but hey.
Now, this is my social media weekly layout. I have no, I normally write my social media layouts or like the videos that I plan down on a piece of paper, fold it up, put it in my purse, in my wallet, in my notebook that I'm doing homework in or whatever, and it kind of gets pushed to the back burner and it never gets done. I end up doing other things for other people always, and then what I want to do kind of gets pushed back. So I'm going to start back putting them in a planner so I can bring y'all more content on specific days. So what I'm gonna use this social media planner for is I'm gonna sit down and make a schedule where you all know on what days, what to expect from from me on those days. Cause I like to do a lot of things and I know it's like I'm all over the place, but I'm just that type of person. And so that's what my channel reflects is who and how I am. And I know a lot of other channels, they do this, this and this, but I am different, hence the name of this channel, All Things Nail, because I do all the things. I don't just do what people expect of me. I do whatever is in my mind at that given moment. But I am going to try to bring some kind of structure to it. And that way y'all can know what to expect. I'm going to try my hardest too and put it in this social planner. But these stickers right here, y'all, I have been looking for these stickers for a minute. I have so many sticker books that <laughs> I'm just not finding it because I wanted one of these stickers to go in my catch-all planner. And I was actually thumbing through the books to find it, but it was in this book. And when I realized it, I came back for it so I can go back and put it in my catch-all planner. But anyway, I hope y'all enjoy all of these layouts. And like I said, I'm new to doing this. I know some people are not going to like it. I've already had some people complaining. And I'm sorry, but this is, I mean, I've been doing this. I started in 2019, but I just wasn't doing the stickers. I was just jotting down dates. And I started actually doing the, de the decorating here recently since my dad passed away. Because um, my therapist kept giving me adult coloring books. And I'm like, eh, I'm tired of coloring let's find some other kind of crafty way and then i pulled out the happy plan and she's like oh that's a good idea that's even you know that's even better because you're even journaling now because i do have like i said the big happy plan i have another planner that you don't see that i journal in and that i don't decorate it's just for journaling and that kind of thing so yeah this is a part of my daily life now I know some of y'all don't like it, like I said, but it's me, and I'm going to keep it real here, 100, all the way, so it is what it is, and I'll try to keep these short, but I have so many requests, I have more requests for it, to do TV show reviews, my weight loss, a couple of other movie reviews people have asked me to do, I just, I've been trying to write things down, this is why I need this social media planner, because the things that y'all request, I need to be able to write them down so I can keep up with everything versus trying to remember everything. Having 25 little notes in my note app on my iPhone that's just all over the place. Now I can write them down in a specific place. Because you see these lists over here under new November. Now I have somewhere to put that, uh, write down those things that y'all request. And I can keep up with them. And I can check them off. Even if I don't get them done, I can go back and see what I didn't do. And carry it over, carry it over to the next month. And be more productive. And give y'all better content. And try to give y'all some of the things that you all request. But I am excited about my weight loss journey. I've just restarted back. It's going well, and I cannot wait to show y'all the way in and get started with y'all. And I hope that somebody else will start with me and we can be motivating each other. And I know I was supposed to be doing this before, but I had that situation with my dad. But now we can get it back on track. Just, I got so much going on in my mind right now that I can't speak on, that I want to tell y'all about, but I'm not sure about, and I don't want to speak about it and not, how do you say it, be, and not be sure about it yet, you know, but I'm excited, and once I know the facts and 
I'm pretty sure about it, then I can share it with you. So please hang in there with me. Don't leave me. Leave it in the comments below. Y'all can also inbox me on Instagram. It's the same name, All Things Now. You can inbox me on Instagram your thoughts or something you would like for me to do, and I will take it into consideration. Can't promise I'll do it, but I can take it into consideration and add it to the list and see if it can be worked in. Okay, now let's punch some holes in here and get these back in the planner and we will be ready to move on to pinning some things into the planner. 